Today, guys, I'm going to be starting up a brand new series on my YouTube channel. This is a very original idea, so if you try and attack me for this, I will invite you to a Minecraft 1v1 on Minecraft Rust, and I will 360 no-scope you with a bow and arrow. So don't try me, please. You don't want to. Uh, so I thought the perfect starter episode to this amazing original series should be homework because it is something people like me can relate to so yeah let's jump in shall we cute amazing transition so um there's a lot of stuff you could say about this but i'm only gonna be going over a couple things so first thing is it's a waste of money i don't know about you americans that are watching this video but here in britain we don't have to spend money on our homework thankfully thankfully we don't have to spend money on homework but the teachers do, they're spending their hard-earned uh, money on homework. And they feel forced to do that. But they don't, because there's no rule saying you need homework. The schools kind of just set that themselves. I don't know about you guys, but a lot of students in my school don't bring their homework back in. So it's a waste of money, basically. You're, the teachers are spending their money on something that the students aren't even bringing back in. So... You know, and then they complain about it, but at the end of the day, there's no law saying you have to give homework to students. You're deciding to do that, so it's your fault at the end of the day, not our fault. So there we go. I mean, that leads perfectly into another point. Like I said, the, the students aren't going to bring it in, and there's many reasons for that. Because one main reason for that is because we have a life too. Yeah, believe it or not, teachers... We don't want to do homework. We don't get home thinking in our head, oh, I, I love school so much. I, I'm going to do my homework right now. Oh, no, I finished my homework. I want more homework. We don't think about that. We don't. Okay, normal students that are sane and are right in the head will come home. And the first thing they'll do is either go out with friends or play video games with the boys. That's how it That's how it works. Um... Or watch YouTube. Or TikTok. I don't know. Whatever, I guess. So, we have a life too. We want to do what we want to do. Like me, for example, I want to make videos like these. I want to enjoy my time making these videos and stuff like that. So, yeah. There we go. We have a life. I mean, we, we're, we're in school for over six hours, correct? There we go. Or six hours or more, I know. Me, personally, I'm in school for six hours or just over six hours. And I want to get home and do what I want to do. I mean, I've done all the work in school and I want to get home and do what I want to do. Or during holidays like Christmas holiday, half term or weekends. I want to do what I want to do. I don't want to worry about homeworks or anything like that. But there are a couple things you need to do, I guess. I mean, if you've got GCSEs and stuff, you need to revise, you need to study, do all of that stuff. But when it comes to homework, which is work you've already done in a class on that day, I mean, there's really no point to it. I mean, we're in the 21st century. Instead of just giving us homework, why not just telling us to Google stuff and read it, for goodness sake? Why waste your money on paper that the students aren't going to bring back in? I mean, is it making sense now, teachers? Is it making sense? I don't know. I mean, you graduated out of school, so it should be making sense for you. Um, another reason is, I mean, on Friday, I was given homework. Okay, there you go. I was giving homework on Friday and it was tipping it down with rain. And I'm sure a lot of you guys can agree that if you've got quite a small bag or just a bag in general, the water kind of comes through. So, you know, all your books and everything in your bag is getting soaking wet. I was given homework on Friday and now it's almost completely ruined. There's holes and stuff in, in it. The staple and stuff is coming out of it because of the weather on Friday. I'm not going to show you the front of it, but it does look pretty, uh, pretty bad, doesn't it? It looks like there's a bullet hole in there. Wow. No. If a teacher's in the classroom... There's windows, right? And if you haven't got windows, there's problems there. But nor most teachers have windows in their classroom. So they can easily look out the window and see, oh, crap, it's raining today. Oh, I, might, I better not give uh, 
homework for my students today because it's probably going to get ruined. No, they give you the homework anyway. And then they complain, oh, you should have just uh, been more responsible. But then if you try and tell them, well, you saw the weather out, they're just going to send you to the head's office or the principal's office, as Americans call it. Um, they're just going to send you there and send send you to the... Uh, oh, my God, the light just came. Bloody hell, that went, that came on by itself. I'm not going to complain if there's a ghost in here, whatever. Hi, ghosts. Make sure you subscribe to Halo Harry, I guess. Um, so, yeah, if there's, if it's a bad weather, most teachers should just think, oh, I shouldn't give it to them because they probably don't have a waterproof bag. But they don't, do they? They give you homework anybody and they tell you off for it. Ha, 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 ha. No, okay, no. So that homework, believe it or not, needs to be in tomorrow. At the time of this recording, it's Sunday, and that homework needs to be in on the 2nd of March, which is tomorrow, which is Monday. Am I going to do the homework? Let me know down in the comments. Say yes or no. And to be honest with you, I'm going to answer your question right now. No, because I'm a hard lad. I'm not going to do the homework. It's going to stay on the floor. I have the high ground. That homework doesn't have the high ground. So, um, yeah, you know where I'm going now. The high ground is key in this situation. That's on the floor, and I'm up here. So, that's going to be staying there. And, uh, yeah, free paper for me, I guess. Um, so, yeah, if it's bad weathers or bad weather, just, just teachers shouldn't give homework, really, should they? And they shouldn't tell you off for not bringing it in. Or if you were to just show it to them and it's all scrambled up and stuff, they shouldn't tell you off because they should have known better. I mean, they did graduate out of school, after all. They did graduate out of university and college, after all. So, they haven't got 75 IQ. They should have way more than that. Um, I think that's going to be the end of this video, because I, I've spoke a lot about... Um, oh, actually, I haven't spoke a lot about homework. I haven't even hit the 10-minute mark yet, but I'm not going to try and stretch out this video, because there's no point. I'm not making money on YouTube. Um, so, yeah... That's homework. Long story short, should teachers give you homework? No, of course not. Why? Because we have a life. It's a waste of money. It's a waste of time. There we go. These teachers, uh, they spend all their time on this homework. They're typing it all down and stuff like that. And then the, the students don't bring it back in. So, yeah, waste of time, waste of money, and we have our own free life, and we want to do what we want to do. We don't want to be trapped inside doing homework. So now that's going to be the end of this video. Like I said, I said I wasn't going to stretch it out for the 10-minute mark, but by the looks of it, we've almost been recording for nine minutes. I'm probably going to edit some of this out. So, um, yeah, guys, my name was Cause Harry Jinx 666 and um, I will see you in my next YouTube ranting video. Next video, we'll be ranting about K-pop stands, and I'm very, very excited about that. So, yeah, guys, see you in my next YouTube ranting video.